Harsh landscapes are most common in moist or tropical temperate climates. In Ireland, these regions, karst regions, can be found in the Burn in County Clare. Karst landscapes normally develop on carboniferous limestone that has either been uplifted by tectonic activity or exposed by denudation. A number of conditions appear necessary for the development of a karst landscape. The limestone should be hard and well jointed. This allows water to follow restricted pathways rather than percolate through rock as a whole. The water table should be well below the surface of the limestone allowing the water to move upwards through the rock. It is the presence of moving water rather than standing water that shapes the landscape. A relatively abundant rainfall is necessary to supply the groundwater system. Limestone is an organically formed rock. It is formed layer upon layer. These layers are called strata. These strata are separated by bedding planes. These are formed by once living organisms. These are cemented together by a cementing agent called calcium carbonate. The vertical cracks are called joints. This whole process happens when all the organisms are compacted and cemented on the ocean floor. Carbonation is the process that causes the limestone to be weathered by rainwater. The rainwater dissolves soluble limestone. As the rainwater passes through the atmosphere, it takes in carbon dioxide and then formulates a weak carbonic acid. This acid reacts with the calcium carbonate found in limestone, which causes the limestone to dissolve gradually. What features are associated with karst areas? Due to chemical weathering, in karst regions we find such features as flints, grikes, swallow holes, and underground features such as caves, stalactites, stalagmites, and pillars. The bare limestone pavements are crisscrossed by deep grooves called grikes. These are vertical joints in the limestone which have been widened by rainwater weathering. The blocks of limestone which separate the grikes are known as clints. Caves in the burn would originally have been solid blocks of limestone over 1.6 million years ago. But with the end of the Ice Age, meltwater began to break up the limestone and to create underground rivers. The rivers would flow and over hundreds of thousands of years it would wear away the layers of limestone until eventually the walls would collapse, creating a cave. In some places, the remains of these rivers can be seen as waterfalls in the caves during periods of rain. Stalic types are formed when the rainwater mixed with the limestone through the process of carbonation reaches the cave roof. Here it forms a droplet. When the droplet falls, a tiny grain of calcium bicarbonate is left behind. Over hundreds of thousands of years, these grains build up to form stalactites. Stalagmites are formed when the droplets of rainwater fall to the floor. When these droplets land in the same place year after year, calcium bicarbonate is deposited in the same place. This then builds up to form a stalagmite. The barren is a botanist's delight with its profusion of calcium-loving plants. These include plants from the Arctic, the Alps and the Mediterranean. 
Many of these plants grow in gripes, which we have a prime example of here. In these gripes, there is little soil. The plants include orchids, genetians, ferns, and avens. It is thought that so many diverse plants have survived here because of the absence of competition from agriculture. Where are you from? France. From France. France. France yeah. And why, what has you here in the burn? What reasons have you for coming to the burn? Uh, because it's a um, school of trip. School trip. Yeah. And do you like the burn, the area? Yes. Yeah. And what's your favorite sort of features of the burn? This side. This the side, yeah? yeah? What makes it so nice? Uh, it's a <laughs> um, You know how you say it. Uh, it's amazing. It's amazing, <laughs> it's it great. is. You walk, uh, and is it nice? Yes. Yeah. Would you recommend it for people to come as just like brother and school trip to come and view the area? It's, it's very special because of the flowers, because of the rocks. Yeah. I love it. Okay.